A special senior night send-off for Eric Terry. Tying a career high with 20 points as the Bobcats celebrate a win over Georgia State to take over sole possession of second place to the Sun Belt by virtue of an 86-76 win over Georgia State. Brent Freeman on ESPN Plus now joined by Eric Terry and again ET. 20 points here for you this evening. Tying a career high. For that to happen for you on your senior day, how meaningful is that for you? Uh, it means the world. Uh, my last day uh, playing on this on this floor it means a lot. And I just have to get it, uh, give give the credit to my team uh, for finding me and believing in me. So that, that's that, that's really it. So looking at the intensity of this game today, again the two teams battling for sole possession of second place in Sunbelt Conference, so much on the line. How physical of a game was it out there today? Man, it's conference play. Every game, every game is going to be physical because everybody's trying to get one up on you. And for us to just come on top, just 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 like really means a lot to us. So you look at this homestand, and Coach Casper told you before it started against Little Rock, this would define your season. Right. You go 4-0. Right. This, there's a bigger stat for you, Eric. You yes. realize the team never trailed at any point in any of those four games. That's crazy. In fact, out of the past seven games, you have held a lead for 256 out of 280 possible minutes. Wow. You guys are rolling right yeah. now. How much confidence is this team playing with currently? Uh, our confidence is through the roof. Uh, but it starts with our defense. Our defense held, uh, held up, and when we stop people on defense, we score. So let's take me back to before the game today. And again, your senior day moment, the chance to come out to center floor, to a center court rather, and be recognized you know, by your friends, your family, your teammates. What did that moment in particular mean to you? Man, it, it meant a lot, uh, especially uh, my family, my family coming out, uh, my cousins. Uh, just everybody that, that just supported me my whole three, uh, three and a half years here. And it just means a lot. And I told myself I was going to cry. And I, I mean, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't cry. I didn't cry uh, at, at the beginning, but I did, I did cry a little bit out there. Right. Yeah, no no the shame in that area yeah. whatsoever. <laughs> sure. Now, the great thing is, is that while the team is in now second place in the Summit of the Conference, the yes, work sir. is not done yet. It's not. You have two games left on the road against yes, rival UTA, and then right. you face arguably outside of yourselves right. the hottest team of the Sun Belt of South Alabama. Yes, sir. So that goal of a top two seed in the bye to the semifinals not accomplished yet. Right. What does the team have to do to carry carry over the momentum from this homestand onto the road road swing coming up? Uh, just to take everything day by day. Uh, it starts with uh, today, but uh, after today, uh, I mean. It starts with this win, and we won. And so after after, uh, after today, we're going to move on to the next. And so it just it just, it just really just uh, take everything day by day. Well, Eric, again, congratulations on the win. And again, tying a career high with 20. And for all of you had you, that you've enjoyed here in your career, yes, enjoy your, your senior day moment. Thank you. Again, Eric Terry and the Bobcats, a win over Georgia State, 86-76. And with that win, they are now alone for second place in the Sun Belt Conference. So for Suzanne Fox, I'm Brian Freeman saying so long from Stranorita. The final score again, Texas State 86, Georgia State 76. All games airing on the ESPN networks are streaming live at archive on the ESPN app. This has been a presentation of ESPN. From San Marcos, good night.